Okay, this is the third and final of my question and answer videos. Uh, Sashimi asked me, when when will I bring myself over and visit the USA? Actually, I've already been there. Uh, back in early 2008. Uh, this was just before the global financial crisis and gold shot through the roof. So, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. As far as... Uh, going back again. Well, I got a friend who I might want to visit, so yeah, I'll, uh, I'll put that down as a maybe. Depends whether I have the money. If I get a job, I probably wouldn't have the time, though I would have the money. Right now, I've got the time, yet it's really... It, plane t intercontinental plane tickets are a bit expensive, and they're not getting any cheaper. Uh, she also asked me, when will I shave? When I got a next job interview. Uh, now, my accent. Some people may have noticed that I sound a little bit British, a little bit American, and very Australian. Now, this is not, in fact, an accident. This is uh, something that happens to people who have a bent for languages when they're younger. Uh, when we watch international TV, and let's face it, all the shows made here in Australia suck. I'm sorry, it's true. Almost, well, ever since... Well, Australian stand-up comedy is good. And sketch comedy shows are good, however, there's not enough of them to go around. So, yeah, as a kid, when I was watching uh, American and British TV shows, which we've got more than enough of here in Australia, because American shows go everywhere, and we are a, f a member of the British Commonwealth, so, of course, we get uh, some actually quite passable British comedy once every so often, I actually started absorbing the accent. It's uh, linguistical osmosis, you could say. So, yeah. Uh, actually, there was... I only ever met one individual. Uh, she was from around about Chicago, I think. Uh, maybe I'm getting that wrong. Uh, she said where she was from. I don't remember. Anyway, I met her when I was uh, working with the Society for, uh, Society for Creative Anachronism. And she accurately spotted, yeah, you just sound like an Aussie, you watch too much American TV, and I just said, bingo. So all those years watching Sesame Street rubbed off on me, and it turns out I've got a natural uh, knack for copying accents and analysing people's voices. No, I don't use it to impersonate anyone online. That would be disingenuous. So, uh, that's my third and final of the question and answer videos. Uh, these ones have been nice and fast. Uh, unfortunately, this window is closed, so my life goes back into the shadows and the mystery. Though, if anyone uh, has anything interesting they want to work with me on, I'm already uh, going to be talking to somebody about a uh, studying sexuality and Taoism. And yeah, I'll see you guys later. Have a good one.